My name is Pat Verrett. I work for WR Grace, and my uh, title is I'm a senior systems business analyst. So I was the business analyst that worked through uh, implementing our ReadSoft solution. Well, in the beginning, we, we were looking at, we had done some automation on our own, uh, but we were looking for a real tight SAP integration. And that was something we couldn't do in-house. So therefore, uh, we um, went down the road of starting to use uh, invoices, and then we, we grew to use Cockpit, and then now we're using WebCycle. So we did it in pieces, uh, but you know, looking back, it would have been nice to just do it all at once and get it done. Yeah. Our goals were basically to reduce our cost per invoice and our, um, um, I'm trying to think of what it's called, our, uh, it's your turnaround time, but there's another word for it. Anyway, our, our turnaround time. Um, in, in the U.S., our cost per invoice was around uh, $5, $5 and something, and uh, last year it was about 2 uh, 250 an invoice, 225, something like that. Wow, so, so you've met your goals then. Yeah, but we also implemented uh, Asia and Europe. So in Asia and Europe, the cost per invoice was seven, seven something, and now it's about $1.50. It's huge, huge difference. You know, but it was a lot of manual processes all over the place. So uh, that consolidation really, you know, met the goals. So. One challenge that we had in implementing was because we were trying to use some of our own solutions and stuff, uh, so it was integrating some of that, but ReadSoft really worked very close with us to do that. But looking back, of course, we would have done better just using all of their products, and that's what we've grown to do now. I, I really feel like that the best part has been resolving problem invoices because you know, we used to have stacks of paper that people were going through and faxing to people. Have you done this yet? What, is this approved, not approved, and all that. And now it, it, they, it's just sending a web cycle to them. And you know, there's a response and you have tracking. And it just, uh, it, the visibility of what you have is huge. Uh, I, I think my, my biggest surprise is it, it amazes me how many invoices we do. Uh, as a company, you know, we do about 440,000 invoices now with the two AP centers, and it's all handled by this solution. It's, it's, it's pretty amazing. Not now, we, we do use, what started us with ReadSoft to begin with is we use the forms product in maintenance. And so we already had a little bit of a relationship with ReadSoft, and we, we came to their conference and found out about invoices and all that. And that's really what kind of started us with ReadSoft. So we started in other departments, but we brought it to AP. My first advice is one, um, you know, everybody wants to know ROI and, and know all that, but my, my big advice is to try to keep it simple. You know, we overcomplicated our implementation, uh, but keep it as simple as you can and just get started because uh, it, the return's gonna be there. So. Well, I work in the manufacturing industry, mm -hmm. and you know, I think what's good about it, I guess all companies are, but in the manufacturing, most of these companies are global, and uh, how can I even say this? Most of these companies are global, so they, they have a lot of payment processing centers all over the place. A lot of times, a lot of plants have one at every location. You know, so this, these tools just um, bring consolidation automation your price down very easily.